ladies and gentlemen, Jonathan Majors. This is exciting. Uh, my name is Jonathan Majors. I'm in the new Netflix Western The Heart of They Fall alongside Idris Elba. Uh, it was fun. It was fun filming that movie, but if you ever want to feel bad about how you look, definitely spend two months standing right next to Idris Elba. <laughs> Humbles you. Uh, growing up, I, I'm a military brat. My father was in the Air Force, my mother's a pastor, so hallelujah, and I moved around a lot. I like to say I was born in California, raised in Texas, educated in North Carolina, roughed up in New York City, and then re-educated in New Haven, Connecticut, which I guess is my roundabout way of saying, yeah, I went to Yale. <laughs> All right, we're talking. Uh, but listen, it's wild. It's really wild to be here uh, on this stage. When they told me I was going to host SNL, I said, that's impossible. For real, for real. I mean, it's been, it's been crazy. It's been a crazy journey. Uh, when I was 17, I was homeless, living in my car, working at Red Lobster and Olive Garden. But you know what? I learned from that experience. You know what I learned? That Red Lobster and Olive Garden are owned by the same parent company, so you can work at both places with no problem. <laughs> Side note, it's crazy how many people got their start at Red Lobster. Both Nicki Minaj and Chris Rock work there. Now, I don't know what they're putting in them cheddar baked biscuits, but it's working. <laughs> But, uh... All right, back. Uh, really, that experience, it, it, taught me, uh, it taught me a lot. It taught me that work hard. If you trust a plan, great things can happen. I've got a beautiful daughter. I'm going to be in the next uh, Marvel Ant-Man movie. <laughs> or, as the black community likes to call it, not Black Panther. <laughs> uh, and now, I am indeed hosting Saturday Night Live. That's dope. Uh, I remember the moment. I remember the moment when, when the weight of all that kind of hit me. Uh, I, it finally sank in. I was laying in bed, looking at the ceiling, and all of a sudden, I got this huge burst of energy, excitement. Boom! Scared your boy. Uh, something big just happened. And it was OK that, that, that it was big, you know? Uh, you couldn't let that, that bigness scare you. And I, and I thought back to this advice my grandpa uh, always gave me. He'd say, a grandson, Everything's big at first, but you walk up on it, you face it. Pretty soon, it's so small, you can put it in your pocket. Which, incidentally, is the tagline for the next Ant-Man movie. <laughs> All right, look, we got a great show for y'all tonight. Taylor Swift is in the house, so stick around. We'll be right back. 